Welcome to the Rusted Garden. Today I'm harvesting kale and taking care of white flies. And I want to show you how to do that. This is actually a Morris heading cabbage. It doesn't form a strong head, it's an heirloom. And I use the leaves just like kale. So in the kales and in my area, I always get white flies. And white flies look like this. These are, looks like little white cotton specks on the undersides of your leaves and if you tap that the white flies white flies come and they will infest the undersides of your leaves kill them off brown them off just like that and you know damage your plant and the infestation can get pretty bad before they get out of control this is how I take care of it and we're just going to use water today so the Mars heading cabbage is right over there you can see that I got in there removed all the bottom leaves all the debris from the bottom all the leaves that were no good or I didn't like for some reason, had the white flies, snail holes in them, looper holes in them, all went right there. The good stuff I picked off, washed, and this will go into the house and I'm gonna cut that up and just cook it down. So when you get to the area that's infested, you've removed all the damaged leaves, you remove leaves that you're going to eat, and you're left with this. This will continue to grow. And if I look in here, you can see right in there those are all white fly marks now before we get into the chemicals even neem oil or even soap we are going to just wash this down uh, with a strong spray these kind of leaves can take the spray the white flies are really frail let me show you how to do that you'll do this over several days and that can control an outbreak without using chemicals so the principle is pretty simple since the white flies are kind of weak we can wash them off the leaves wash the eggs off wash the immature white flies to the ground and they're going to die. So we removed all the debris, took out the leaves we're going to eat, doesn't leave us many to deal with, and you just get in there, and again, I can see the white flies under there. Spray each leaf down with water and really give it a spray. They will wash off, you're not gonna see them on there. You're disturbing them as they're hatching, as they're trying to feed, as they're trying to lay eggs, and you just go and basically bathe all your plants, the undersides, do this for a couple of days, and that can take care of an outbreak without having to use any kind of harsh chemicals, even soapy water. If this doesn't work after a couple of days, you may go and then try the soapy water, try the neem oil, and kind of work your way up. But start with the uh, most chemical-free, H2O. Hope you enjoyed the video. Please check out my seed shop at www.therestedgarden.com and this is a great way to take care of white flies on your leafy greens. Thanks.